I can see the entrance to Altus Lavoir. Are we going to need a security code? No, but getting ourselves inside might prove to be a bit of a challenge. Huh? You'll find out. Halt, outsider. Who are you? I'm Royal Guard Quiel. I'm under direct orders from Oracle to protect the ruins. Do you know this is a restricted area? Wait, wait, but we are here to do a favor for Oracle? Even so, I can't let anyone in who isn't qualified. Qualified? If you manage to defeat me, I'll let you pass. Well, if that's the case... Very good. I underestimated your ability to fight on equal footing with the Alpha Natiba. It was an honor to spar with you. We can enter now, right? Yes. Altes Lavoir has been contaminated by Natibas for a long time. No one has ever made it back alive. However, with you, I have hope. Blade stopped working all of a sudden. The drone scan isn't working either. Hold on. This is bad. There's an unusual electromagnetic security field disrupting the system. There should be Natibas around here. Ah, equipping the drone is still possible. Same goes for shooting at range. I guess we should thank Lily for that. That's more than enough. Entering now. Same. <sighs> On the floor, step back. front of you. 
that's one way to greet people. Wow! This place! It's filled with capsules. Was it a research facility? It's open. Let's head to the gates. Great, let's move to the next area. I'm detecting a fusion cell in that generator. Let's get it out of there. on the other side's open.
laser is on. Let's go down. Subjects are alive. Success. study nativas or yes they might have done the lee after all knowing your enemy is often the first step towards defeating them but this place seems more like a manufacturing facility to me Without a 
single scratch. Contamination is advancing here. This is security code. It will definitely come in handy. Look for a different route. We can take a detour through the vent. Try entering the code. It worked. My camp is here as well. Uh, let's take a breath anyway. The Natibas here. They look almost human. These Natibas are definitely different from the ones on the surface. 
A lot of them aren't even on our list of nativas. Elder, you're keeping something from us. What is it? Hypercell's preservation status is good. Great. Be careful with it now. You should head back. I'll have the pod waiting for you once you go outside. Huh? Wait. There's... There's a legacy here. A legacy? What's that? It's a device with records left by the airborne squad before me. They leave important information for the next airborne squad. I see. But... Why would an airborne squad come all the way here? Maybe they knew something about the Alpha or the Elder. I'll check the legacy. Day eight after the second dive. Third record. Legacy account Raven. Remaining survivors Ripley and Anis. Anis is in a bad condition. Death is very likely at this rate. We discovered this laboratory, 4.47 kilometers from the drop-off point. It seems to be a facility that studied Nativas, but it's hard to obtain accurate information due to severe contamination. However, I discovered an astonishing fact while searching through the data. Before the war we call the Final War, there was another war. It was a war fought between humanity 
and the androids humanity had themselves created, the so-called Andro-Ados. Humans lost the war against their own creation. The few humans who did survive hid in underground facilities, but the hunt was far from over. However, an unexpected factor turned the tide of the war. With mankind at the verge of extinction, Natiba's powerful creatures from an unknown origin appeared out of nowhere. The war with the Natibas brought about the destruction of the androids. And so, during this time, mankind was able to make its escape to the colony. From now on, I plan to investigate the origin of Natibas. Hopefully, at the origin point, I should find the elder Natiba. To anyone who may be watching, may Mother Sphere's blessings be with you. I didn't think a record like this existed. And there was another big war before the final war. I never learned about anything like that at the colony. What do you think, Adam? The history of mankind is riddled with conflict. It's hardly a surprise to hear about wars before the final war. Even so, it's strange that this wasn't passed down. I'll retrieve the legacy and go back. Wait a moment, Eve. I can pick you up with the tetrapod. Okay, I'll be waiting. Oh, as expected. My eyes did not deceive me. Excellent work, Adam. I'll leave this one to you as well. Let's go to the hyperdrive. Secondary drive energy injection. Initiating activation. Yes, what we're doing is really worth it. Once again, thank you. Now it's your turn. Wait, he will give you an answer. There's a sewage treatment facility and a train graveyard in the old city center. I am detecting the frequencies of an Alpha Nativa coming from Matrix 11. Matrix 11? I will forward the map data to the Tetrapod. It will guide you as you attempt to travel to the Alpha Nativa's location. Thanks for helping us. It means a lot. None of this can compare to all that you have done, Prezion, I assure you. <clears throat> I wish you luck. The town seems different. I see more people, more signs. I told you, what we've accomplished has been well worth it. I don't think we'll be catching any more sideways glances. Well, that's great to hear, to be honest. I was getting a bit anxious. I'm heading over to the Tetrapod. Why don't you take some time to enjoy the new scenery? <laughs>